Hello, my kings and queens and the non-binary in betweens. It is me, TGTB. That all rhymed, and I am so happy. I'll do this all the time. No, what? I'm just gonna stop now because <laughs> I'm gonna keep trying, and then it'll just stop, and it'll just be embarrassing. This is gonna be fun. I can't wait to see the sass of Old Moon. I just can't wait to just see this again. I want to know what's going on. I want to see the character developments. And I just want to have fun. I mean, who doesn't want to have fun? Also, I'm considering making my channel also Sander Sides on channel as well. Because I know for a fact as soon as the next episode comes out, I am I am doing a reaction because... <laughs> that show's about psychology. <laughs> and it's also one of my favourite comedians of all time. Why? This Kingdom Hearts. Yes, Ew. it is. Oh, and PTSD. Oh, yes, the PTSD. Oh. Huh. Uh. Hey. What's up? Oh, you're the new me. Look at you. All fancy. Uh, yeah. You haven't changed one bit. <laughs> nope, what you want? Came to talk. Ah, you came to talk. I forgot you're the more social one. <sighs> yeah, sure, what do you want? Um... How much are you aware of? Nothing. Kind of just been here, staring at the sun, burning my corneas. Saw the red. That so is that why you're at the red, mate? <laughs> isn't how that would work. We're, I know we're machines, you idiot. Had to be some way to distinguish us. So Monty made my eyes red. All right. Um, again, you seem very aware of what's going on. My consciousness woke back up, kind of piecing things together. Seeing as that you're here, I'm assuming you plugged in. So, are you going to ask questions or are you going to waste my time? Uh, I guess you I haven't changed ask one bit, Good. my friends. Get on with it. Okay. Do you regret anything that you did while you were alive? Do I regret anything? God, yes, I regret a lot of things. I am the sole cause of every problem you've experienced. Aside from Stitch Wraith, which I don't give a sh** about that. I made Eclipse. Because I didn't want to deal with my own code. Which then led to Kill Code, which then led to me going, What do we? Get the bucket. You know, all that jazz. Yeah. So yeah, I regret a lot of things. There's a lot I don't regret, like protecting my family. Anything involving protecting them, I would do again in a heartbeat. That's good, at least. Including dying. It meant KC got to live. That's why I did it. I don't care if he's dead now. How do you... Again, consciousness is kind of awake again. Kind of getting glimpses of what's going on. Or what has happened. Have you been able to move? No. This place didn't even conceptually exist until you woke me back up. Which, even then, I'm not really conscious. Kind of just here. And the only reason we're here is because it was the last place I was. Okay, it's the last thing that has any significance to me. Kind of just this entire island is burned into my brain. Our brain. No, mine. Yeah, you don't even like Kingdom Hearts. Uh, really? Yeah. That's the weird thing. Because technically we're the same individual, but our interests do seem to have some distinct differences. What with those? Oh, you're asking questions still, Moody. Oh, my friend, you're home. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, that's how what I. Mooney. Moon. Lunar called the old Moon Mooney. So I, I. And I love that nickname. So yeah, we're keeping it that way. I liked Kingdom Hearts, regardless of how awful the game series is. Uh, you don't like it at all because of how awful it is. Uh, 
you don't yell at people when you get angry, which is honestly a good thing. Uh, we just had anger management problems. I had anger management problems. Uh, so I yell at people when I get angry. And you just kind of bottle it up for a little while. Sometimes come to a plausible solution. Sometimes you go to therapy. Oh, by the way, uh, it must be weird having a sister. I barely got over the fact of Lunar being a brother. Did you not want... Of course I wanted him to be a brother. Kid was lost. He was made for a sole purpose of ruining my life, which he didn't even want to do. His Eclipse. Well, let's be honest. Eclipse was a flaming <laughs> Still is. Awful, awful entity. Which I, which I created again. <laughs> never gonna live that down. Woo! Go yes, you are truly never gonna live this down. And I want to see what, what Moon has to respond to you, Moony. Oh, me. Are you okay? <laughs> no. Of course I'm not okay. I'm talking to the version of myself that got to live. Are you resentful of me? Resentful of you. That's like asking if I'd be resentful of the dog that got water. You reaped the benefits of what I sowed. I don't really care. As long as you don't hurt my family, I don't care what you do. They're my family too. I know, idiot. We share a family, we share a body. But if they come to harm, I understand I'm in a permanent state of catatonic, whatever. But somehow, some way, there will be a retribution of, of my making, whether directly mm -hmm. or indirectly. So you protect them with your life. Give it up again if you have to. I'm not going to do that. You're not going to do that. Why is that? Because you don't believe it's good for them to go through that loss again. Loss happens. I don't, I'm not expecting you to just keel over and die. Again, I really don't care. I just want my sacrifice to not have been in vain. All right. Good. Why do you keep following me? Because I'm having a conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just very odd you're hovering. Because you keep walking places. Yeah, because I haven't been able to move. Again, permanent state of catatonic. So why do you want to go for a swim? I'll do what I want when I please. For now. Now, come on, I'm sure you got more questions than just those. Because, let's be honest, those questions kind of sucked. <gasps> you are a sarcastic ass. Correct, and people loved me for it. For some reason. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, to be fair, you also do that. Now, questions. Come on, chop, chop. Yeah, I'm sure you got things you want to do. Come on. Don't you got a safe solar? Yeah. I am loving this. I'm loving this. And of course, there is a difference between Old Moon and this Moon. I mean, the Old Moon wasn't this sassy, but he had to, did have a lot of sass. And of course, we are actually seeing some kind of... Because he hasn't... He's just woken up. And he's just noticed all of this stuff happening right now. So we're seeing his immediate emotional emotional state you know like uh, I don't really know what to compare it to uh, kind of like um giving a child your uh, giving a um lost a um like orphan a, a sad orphan a um toy you had your whole life like giving that giving that up to give it to them so then they have a little bit of happiness. Yeah, that is that is a good analogy. So come on, ask your questions. Is there anything you wish you could have done while you were still alive? Hmm. Well, kill Eclipse. But, uh, you seem to deal with that in your own way. Which uh, doesn't involve wringing his throat. I'm not sure I agree with that one, but, yeah. Uh, what else, what else, what else? Hmm. I guess just a legacy. Would have been nice to leave a legacy. Wow, well, hello, Hamilton. <laughs> legacy. What is a legacy? Putting seeds in a garden to some... Seeds in a garden they'll grow to something. You'll never get the seed. The scent for me, you rise. It's the only way to rise. 
I remember that so much it feels more like a memory. When is it gonna get me? If I see it seven feet ahead of me, if I see it coming, do I run or do I let it be? Is it like a beat without a melody? See, I never thought I'd live past 20. When it comes from, some gets to half as many. Ask anybody, why with the last of the crafts we eat from the blast? Yes, we have to make the most last. That's plenty. Stop that. This isn't the moment. With the movement, but we've got hungry brothers with something to prove when foes oppose us. We take an honest stand. Rolls like Moses, claiming upon his land. And if we win our independence, a guarantee of freedom for our descendants, we'll. Will the blood be shed because can kill of endings and death with no defendants? I know the actions in the street is exciting, but Jesus be between all the bleeding and fighting. I've been reading the writing. We need to handle our financial situation. Were we a nation of states? What's the state of our nation? The grass as we wasting the clash and the smash. Every exploitation, every act is an actual creation. I'm laughing into places, of casualties of sorrow. But the first time I'm thinking past tomorrow. I'm sorry, I just started doing that. I'm sorry. The thing I left in my remembrance is pain and misery. I didn't really leave anything good to be remembered from me. And now there's you, who's leaving a positive impact on everything I lived through. So, no, I don't necessarily have anything to tell you, hey, do this for me. Because it's pretty pointless to do that. I lived how I lived. That's something we say. Isn't that right? I live how I live. And I lived like the bad guy. And you live like the good one. So, keep making some positives. That's enough for me. You just want me to keep being me? Yeah, I want you to keep being you, idiot. You're me. Without all the hate and anger and the trauma I caused our brother. I regret that every day. And I know Son says he's sorry. So you deliver this for me. Tell him. I can never apologize enough for what I did. And I can't even commit the actions to begin to atone for it. I want him to live his best life. That's all I've ever wanted. That's why I did what I did. Do I think all of what I did was right? No. God, no. I've hurt him in more ways than I can count. My family is the only- I'm actually starting to cry. It's like, when it comes to this kind of stuff, the stuff makes me cry and I actually am sorry to cry. The thing that mattered to me. When I woke up, all I felt was absolute anger. Because I I wasn't even given a body. So I spent our existence forcing him into submission so I could get a body. And when I got one, I was happy. And I know that at a point, me and him came to an agreement, but I know I still caused him pain every night. So, I got a body. And even though I did that, I could finally live freely in my own way. What did I do? I left behind a part of what made me me. Because I didn't want to hurt him anymore. And all I did was hurt him worse. I am the root cause of everything. And that is an undisputed fact. Oh, this is what I wanted. This is what I wanted, people. Again, listen. I know a lot of you are people are saying he hasn't changed one bit. I say right now, go back to the other videos before he died. And literally, how long has it been since everyone has binge watched the entire series? I don't have time to do that, but oh god, do I do... Do I watch certain episodes over and over again? Because it's hilarious. <laughs> I burned a building down. That's my training. You did what? I burned down a building. You burned down a building? It was a very big fireball. You knocked down a building? I didn't knock it down. I burned it. It just started missing some windows. That episode I watched so much. <laughs> and if I'm being honest, I don't want some to come speak with me. Because I don't know how I'll act. If I'll be a coward, if I'll be angry, if I'll scream at him, if I'll hit him again. I don't know what I'll do. So I'm not going to take the risk. My family is simply everything. And I'm sure I would have loved Earth and Lunar just as much if I would have had the chance. Same with Solar. But you have that chance. You have their love. So never squander it. Protect them. And I shouldn't ask you to throw away your life to do that. But I want them to be safe. And don't... I am 
actually crying. Oh my god. <sighs> and you guys say he was a jerk. He's just a he's just a fellow scientist in my eyes, and he will forever be my one of my favorite characters. And that's right. They'll throw away their lives for you. Especially son. I can only guess that the thought that's gone through his head. That Moon gave up himself for me. So I should give up myself for him. And while it's a noble thought, it's also the dumbest thing I've ever heard. <sighs> Any other questions? Any other messages you want me to deliver? Any other messages? Yeah. Tell Monty thank you for being my best friend. Somebody I could rely on. He pulled me out of a lot of gutters mentally. And I truly appreciate him for that. Tell Eclipse to go kill himself. Really hate him still. I don't care if he's not trying to kill you or the others. He did kill Lunar. And he's lucky I'm not the one alive. And tell Earth and Lunar. I wish I got to meet them. I always wanted a sister. And a little brother. Well, I technically met Lunar, but I never really got to know him. Tell him I regret not spending more time with him. Uh, didn't really speak to anybody else, so that's really about it. <laughs> oh. I just love how he just, like, I didn't really speak to anyone else, but so that's really just it. Right after he just, like, that serious moment of emotion, but then he just comes around back with the sass. <laughs> By the way, uh, yeah, Foxy hit on us once. Uh, that was a different version of him, but whatever. Still weird. Creepy. Yeah. Okay. Um, are you okay with this? With what? Sitting here staring at the sun for all eternity. Yeah, I don't care. Again, I lived how I lived. And I could have had a worse ending. So... No complaints here. Your life is what you make of it. So live it to the best. Oh my god, I'm gonna be quoting him so much when I become a therapist. I am going to do that so much. <sighs> I could be quoting this episode so much, oh my god. <laughs> That's my last piece of advice for you. Goodbye. Me. Yeah. Goodbye, me. I'll live a life that made us both proud. Good. If you don't, I'm sure I can find some way to kick your ass. I'm sure you could. Oh, by the way, you've never been inferior. You've been holding yourself back out of fear. Think big. If you want to rule the world, then rule it. Don't be a coward. Yeah. The world's what I make of it. All right. Thank you. Me. <laughs> Make me cry seriously. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Mm. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. I missed Mooney. I missed my boy. And yes. He is my boy because he's essentially the living me embodiment, including the entirety of his anger management issues. Yes. The new moon is similar, but the moon is just a carbon copy at this point. Wait. An iron. Wait. Iron, magnesium, iron, magnesium, uh, Titanium, whatever, copy. <laughs> so yeah, it's nice to see him again. I'm going to have to take a bit to process everything. And Man Moon has a lot of stuff to go through. Like, go through. And I... I expected, I honestly... I'm not surprised about Mooney's reaction to Eclipse. And I gotta say this for right now. Moon, do not tell up uh, do not tell Eclipse that message because he's trying to change. And I 
do not think that would help. At all. Okay. <clears throat> Please like, subscribe, comment down below, check out my Reddit. And I'll see you in the next one. See you later, my kings and queens and the non-binary in-betweens. Bye-bye.